45-year-old Rampati Kurmi is a busy farmer in a remote Hatibangai village of the Rupandahe district, 300 km west of Kathmandu. While her husband and sons were involved in the election campaign, Rampati was busy managing newly harvested rice. She is happy this year as production of this staple food was good. Thanks to educational training and seed support from the National Wheat Research Program (NWRP). Rampati is a member of the local group of farmers a group comprising 60 households from the Hattibangai village which is getting improved seeds and educational training from NWRP on the effects of climate change. One such training was on nitrogen management using leaf color chart to mitigate nitrogen loss and reducing environmental and groundwater pollution affecting rice fields. As literacy rate is low among women in Hatibangai, training them on climate change has taken much effort. The male life is sixty years old. Some poor family is sixty years old. Purush life is very old. Purush buy the job. Very very little technology. The house party buy the job. Job no sense. So male life is sixty years old. I am very little technology. Some poor house go go. Our member our level is sixty. अतिव धारणा अनुसार हम नारकले अथवा राष्ट्रीय गांव वाले अनुसंधान कार्यले हमें तेज अनुसार कार्यक्रम कर रहा है। हाथी बंगाई इस वन ऑफ़ द रूलर विलेजेस इन रुपंदे डिस्ट्रिक्ट। द उमन आउट हियर यू कैन सी आर वेरी एक्टिव इन फार्मिंग एंड नाउ सम आर यूजिंग द लेथर्स मेथड्स प्रोवाइडेड बाय एग्रीकल्च Compared to a few years ago, women's participation in agricultural-related discussion programs has increased substantially in villages such as Hatibangai. And women who used to stay behind the scene are now coming to the fore. <laughs> According to 2011 census, the number of households headed by women in the country increased from 15% to 25% in the last 10 years. However, it will take them more time to achieve a leading position in this patriarchal society. Environmental experts say women have been contributing more in fighting climate change effects and yet they are one of the groups which will be most severely affected by it. Given this vulnerability, their role from ground to policy label is equally important. Gender has to be set at the center of climate change agenda. But at the moment in Nepal context, I would say that the gender issue is still a long way to be recognized at the disc both in uh, policy level discussion and also policy making processes. As men leave the home districts and country to look for jobs elsewhere, more women like Rampati are now doing agricultural work. That's why for these women, more awareness also means more effectiveness in protecting the environment.